Hey Cranny, how, how you doing man? All good? I'm gonna be working on this guy tonight because I need to finish this guy ASAP. It's been so long, so I'm trying to find something, some music for my process because I need to be like, you know, there. And I think I just found something. I, I like to I like to use um, electronic music. It gets me right there. I'm taking a picture for Instagram so I can actually you know put this guy right there. Tell the people I'm I'm about to start a live stream, guys. I can record a video right here. Hey guys, I'm about to start a live stream. There you go. Woo. Okay. Hey guys, I'm about to start a live stream. He's right there. I put this right here in the cell phone and it's just in case. Alright guys, the live stream. Hey Angel, cuánto tiempo compadre? Gracias por estar aquí viejo. Alright, tonight I'm gonna be working a lot more in the, the armor and uh, those pieces that I actually sat, the, you know, the in the last in the last um, stream that I did. Hey Michelle, how you doing? Damn, good to have you here, girl. <laughs> it's Michal, sorry. Sorry about that. Michal, right? Right? <laughs> I'm so glad to be here, guys. It's been a long time. I have been so, so freaking busy. I haven't done any tutorials for my YouTube channel. Sorry about that. It's been like two weeks working straight in this let me show you right now how, what I've been you know let me show you right now give me one second guys okay, this is really really cool I just finished um, my second pay tutorial and let me show you right here let me this okay what I did was I divide this guy in three pieces so if you want to get the tutorial you just go and just pay in a small amount of money, this it's still like three dollars, I think three ninety five, I think it is. So you can get a tutorial because the the, the full circle cost like eleven ninety five, something like that. So this is the whole process that I did for uh, for this guy. I from scratch, I sculpted the whole thing. Let me let me show you a little bit about this guy because I'm pretty excited about this. And let me show you right here. Let me find it. The course name is Sketching Creatures in Blender. And this is the first tutorial. So there's going to be a lot more coming. That's for sure. And uh, Okay. This is the folder for the whole thing. Everything from scratch to, you know, the finished process. And there is so much here. Oh, gosh. There's so much. From just a single cube to, like, everything. The, the whole process here in, the, in this guy. This is like a uh, basic, basic uh, base that I did for for that guy. All right, so no more uh, interruption about that guy. It's right there. You can find it here in the scrutin training zone. The whole process, like I said before, there's a you there's a YouTube video about uh, about this guy. Let me see if you can find it here. One second. Uh, <clears throat> I'm pretty excited about this because it took me like probably like two straight weeks because I had to edit the whole thing and trust me it was so much to do this is the video that I'm working that I'm you know talking explaining the the whole process that I did and 
for the for this character. So I need to get back to my usually tutorial process. So hopefully uh, this week I can actually finish like a two or three tutorials for uh, Mini Tutorial Series and the Dragon and a lot of stuff that I had to update. But I was actually busy. All right. Okay. So where's the hammer guy? There you go, hammer guy. Let me close this right here. So what I'm gonna be doing today? I'm gonna be like I said before. I'm gonna be working just in the armor. I don't need that guy. Oh, I added some chains. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it because, to be honest, I, I, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I want to keep those chains right there. Mm, kind of like it. I don't know. It just comes it so. Oh, by the way, Craig, I, I started today doing like a, um, a sculpting crunch thing in C Rush because I, I needed I need to get back to my sculpting time with C Rush. It's been a long time since the last time I did. The other day, I actually did a live stream in, in um, Twitch. It was crazy because it's been so long since the last time I actually did a live stream with C Rush, just C Rush. Not anything else. <laughs> oh my god, was, that was crazy. Alright, let me get, find some references here for this guy because this is going to be awesome. Let me see if I can find where is uh, the reference that I have for armors. That's, that's my advice for you guys. If you do any project, always get and uh, you start sculpting or modeling or whatever you're doing just with some uh, references. It's going to help you a lot. It's going to help you so much. To actually find like different shapes, different things that you don't have in your mind that moment. So it's gonna be like um, a good thing to do. All right, let me pass this right here to the other monitor because I need to get right there. All right, let's see. So how are you guys today? What are you doing? What are you up to? Hey, Mihal, how are you doing there in your project for the contest? Okay, I think I got this right here. I found this image. <clears throat> All right, let's see. I don't want to be too crazy with this guy in the armor because. Uh, right here. That's my. There you go. Um, this right there, and the other that I have here somewhere. All right, I think. Okay, yeah, there we go. Good. I got what I need. And setting up the images in the other monitor so I can see what I'm doing here. Okay, there you go. Alright, let's do it. So, so far I have a lot of pieces here. A lot of, this is just a concept. There's no details. Only a few pieces have the actual details that are going to be uh, letting here. I just, I don't know, I don't know yet. But there is still like uh, some, this little hammer right there. I think I had to school to actually, uh, create some damage and stuff here in this guy that's probably gonna be another video but today I just need to model and create more stuff this piece right there that's gone I, I, I want to take that off because I did that in the last live stream just because I needed to put something there but I actually hate it I don't like it so I'm just gonna move it from there there you go I just gonna put something much better right there you're gonna see what I want to do That's really good. That's really good, man. I want to see that. I want to see that coming. I need to... Lately, I haven't, I haven't used the... The add-on that I bought for, uh, for uh, painting in Blender. I haven't used it, actually. I need, I, I, I need to do it because I haven't, I haven't got any time. And I just started this new job and it's taking me 
It's taking me a lot of time, and but it's pretty awesome. All right, no more complaining, and let's 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 get yeah that one big painter yeah yeah exactly. I need to get need to get back to that. I just tried, I just tested. It was it was really good. It was I had to say it was really good. The interaction with the brushes and stuff is really cool. <laughs> Seriously? Come on, Craig. All right, let's let me separate this piece right there. And let me hide the other thing. Go here. So let me start painting some comps it here. I'm gonna be here for a few hours, guys. If you're, you know, available, you can, uh, you know, keep around. You know, make me company, guys. Come on. Oh, guys, can you share the video? Let the people all, you know, copy it somewhere, whatever. Alberto is live stream right now. Oh, gosh. <laughs> okay, I need to create a plane from here to here, like a strap or something. I want to create a light from this corner here, but it doesn't make any sense. But it's, it's not going to grab anything. If you, if you see the concept, it's better if it's straight. It's going to be more... I know it looks like it's actually holding something. If you put it right here, it's gonna look like it's loose or something. I don't know. I wanna see I wanna give it this guy this some feeling of you know that you can act, it's it's a strong uh concept. Alright, let me create a plane right there. Surprise. Uh, right there. Let me activate this guy right there. You know what? Wait. I'm gonna this and these two guys are pretty awesome. And I just go here. <clears throat> okay, more straps, more stuff. Just going to I'm gonna be working with B surface today. Oh my gosh! Yeah, it's been a while since the last time I worked with that, and I'm using the, my um, my daily characters that I'm creating right now for my current job for retopology, and it saved me, me a lot of time. Okay, so what I'm going to do here? I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna put it on the other side, and I'm gonna create some kind of stitches here. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put it right there and I'm gonna extrude it here. But this gonna you know what, let me turn off this, I'm gonna do this kind of thing. And I'm gonna put it right there. I remember those days when I used to do like everything just freaking perfect and I was upset because something was like you know not aligned or something and I noticed really late that actually uh, nothing is actually perfect if you see something in real life there is gonna be if for example I'm looking right now on my tablet and there is line there is um, uh, things that is not everything is like completely uh, completely like uh, covering something I don't know how to right now like hmm well if you see a car it's always gonna be a seam so it's not gonna be perfectly covered or something like that and if you actually put that in your mind you're gonna learn that to be faster do whatever you're doing. Can we put this down right now, like that? And one more right here. And we'll go back. Now let me add the uh, modifiers solidify. Bam! Mm, solidify, there you go. Whoosh! It's huge! 
not too much there you go and let me pull this out there you go so I can actually see what I'm doing here and control V you know let me activate uh, screencast key screencast keys there you go that guy right there and, hmm. and I'm in occlusion so I can see a little bit better I have dark gray yeah okay yeah. select this one oh, this one looks pretty awesome the shading looks awesome I think this stripe looks a little thin so I'm just gonna up, you know more and more I'm gonna put right here. I can do the same with this side, so just gonna put right there. What I'm gonna do with this is just let me activate that. Mm. Oh, by the way. There's a way to activate uh, the snip, this you know the snap tool from the keyboard is shift tap. If you press shift tap, it's gonna activate. Shift tap to just, you know deactivate that. It's pretty useful. Mm. So, can you hear my voice like good or it's too loud or the music is too loud? What's happening, guys? Come on, talk to me. This right here. There you go. When I add the uh, subdivision surface, it's gonna be much, much better looking because right now it looks like old faces and stuff. <clears throat> put this here something like that this is gonna be on top of this of course but then it's up to school team what are you doing man what are you up to the atom I need to use that atom I bought the atom but I haven't I haven't used it. I don't. I don't even know how I, you know, I will use that ad actually. Okay, something like this. Mm, but it needs to be looking really tight, so I just gonna put this right there. I'm gonna go down a little bit. But uh, I'm sharing the link right now on Facebook. I said on Facebook I wasn't live, but I didn't put the the link. Okay, right there. What the heck is that? Oh, <laughs> something weird had just happened. Okay. the same process here I can actually 
Let's see if I can do something here. That worked with uh insane control mm. Anyways, I can actually duplicate this. to go on the merge Hey Blender ayuda que tal como estás compadre bienvenido aquí al live stream Saludos de Las Vegas Argentina Wow que horas por allá Okay, let me put this right there. Let me go back and just start, you know, accumulating everything here because. Wow. Oh my god. That's yeah, that's pretty late. It's A forty three here. Ocho quarenta y tres por acá. Kinda early here. Alright, there you go. This actually looks much better that the other thing that I have here but I guess when you're in a live stream sometimes you actually well there's no much time to think but right now I'm I'm yeah I have a pretty good idea with what I want so No, oh, okay. Uh, let's see. Mm. Let me add a mirror. Hora de desayunar, oh my god. No, no. Las Vegas, ahí, Las Vegas está caliente. It's pretty freakishly hot in Vegas right now. Whoa. Freaking hot, it's crazy. Okay, let me again. This is the, the back, but I think let me see if I can this if this is gonna work. You can I, I can actually duplicate this to the other side and I just do something. Let me see if it, if, if it's gonna work. I think we're right there, I'm gonna edit mode and I'm gonna press S Y negative one enter control N no, control A scale control N. Okay, let's see now. I need to move this to the other side. To that place right there. Yeah, of course it's gonna be Yeah. Uh, más o menos. Yeah, 
se, se puede decir que sí. Ya se puede decir que sí. Son generalmente amigables. Bueno, depende de dónde vayas también. Can I add another subdivision in the middle? But so far, I just need to accommodate this whole thing. So this can have some better looking. Eh. La verdad, yo no interrumpo. Uh, aquí es como. Es muy diferente. No te molesta, la verdad. Nadie te molesta aquí. No a menos que te lleves con las personas, ¿verdad? A menos que conozcas a alguien. Generalmente te mudas a algún lugar y pues. No conoces a nadie, ¿entiendes? Pero hasta ahora no he tenido ningún problema yo con. this that right there and first let me put this to see because something I think something split here. No, no, no. Yo soy cubano. Yo sé de lo que te, yo sé de lo que estás hablando. Y no, no, no se, no se compara como menos que vivas en Miami. <ríe> I'm not gonna spend too much time on this piece because, like I said before, this is just a concept. You can't spend too much time on just a concept. You need to be, you need to move fast. Let's put it there, get it out, and and done.
Yo como acostumbrada específicamente esa parte allá cuando, cuando viví en Cuba. Alright, I need to write there. I'm gonna put some stitching, some kind of. What is this? Get up. Alright, there you go. Mm -hmm. To put some more straps, maybe. Yeah, I like this guy. And I need to put, let's see, something here in the back to actually hold that right there to hold this I don't know what it is yet como unos van a ser cuatro años ya let's see ok, let me hide hold it, the hand guy ok a lot of stitching here what else what else can I put in this guy I already got the hammer no hammer oh knives and stuff huh more knives this guy is the hammer it's a hammer guy I need knives and that kind of thing said yeah this guy can fight because I'm not just gonna be that bad Hmm, all right. I need to put something here too. Some details in that. And I'm pretty sure, yeah, what I'm gonna put there, but. Chisels? Oh, interesting. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, I can put. Yeah. Huh. Okay, let me model, let me model some chisels. Thank you for the tip, Craig. I put this here, and we got a cylinder. Okay, right there. Let's see. Mhm. Mm some subdivisions here. I have a few references here and damn there's a lot of reference about that. Steel punch. <laughs> yeah that texture is gonna be awesome. Yeah I can actually make a set of you know uh steel punch and put it in uh, like in the sack or something on the side that's that can be pretty awesome yeah why not okay let me see i got some references here let me see which one i can actually so pretty awesome oh okay let's keep going Create something here. Interesting. Small. Uh, yeah. Okay. Mm. Hey Harbage, how you doing man? Thank you for being here dude. And yes, I'm gonna put I'm gonna be putting this video for my patrons and after a few days I'm gonna release the, the original in YouTube. The whole process. I also did. So if my patrons they, they can see it, so the live stream I put right there after a while. 
so they can actually, you know, see the process. Okay, I'm gonna put my, my reference. Okay, I got the reference right there. Ooh, this some freakish, freakish nice. Hmm, I like that. Huh, okay, ooh, I like this one. Okay, put right there, something like this. And then I'm just gonna go here and like that. Ooh, yeah. I like it. Bam. Mm. <laughs> and let me go like that. Let me put in two. And I'm gonna put this right there. Delete this. All faces. Give it a filling of like that. And I kind of probably made like uh, something to put all these um, things. One more right here. Oh yes, there you go. Nice shape. Yep. It's gonna be wood. I'm gonna delete this right there. You know what? Let's do something here. like that. Nice. We love it. We activate this. I don't need anymore. And right there. And right there. Hey, Nate. Damn. Good to have you here, man. Yeah, I saw in, the, in Discord you were playing with uh, unity. <laughs> All right, there you go. Let me see for the size for the base. Yeah, that's that's pretty accurate. Yeah, you love unity, man. I'm getting there. Freakishly awesome. Now that I'm actually creating character to put her inside of Unity, I actually need to know a little bit more about Unity. Because the game is in Unity, so I need to get, you know, involved in that. I don't like that. Let's see. Alright. Uh, thank you, man. Look at this. I created a hammer. I'm not pretty, you know, happy with the chains. I have no idea if I'm gonna keep it. What do you think? VG. Oh no. I did. I trabajé con VG cuando estaba en Venezuela. Hey Joe, how you doing, man? Welcome to the live stream, man. We put this just right there, and let's see, right there. And I'm gonna move the right there. Okay, there you go. Uh, chisels. All right. So I just gonna duplicate. Going to duplicate this little piece right there because I'm not gonna do it again. Can I select it? You know what? Go here and say ultimate display and bam. Ultimate display. Gonna move the whole thing down. You know what? Hmm. Let me take this off. I'm doing the things. Okay. 
There you go. Okay, something like this. Oh, see. It took you a to out of smooth for uh, parallel normals. Sin tener que añadirle un subdivision surface or something like that. Te hace un smooth la superficie. En caso de que esté utilizando. Por ejemplo, voy a añadir un cilindro acá. Y lo voy a esto faceteado, ¿verdad? Si voy aquí le digo out of smooth. Let me go for it. Let me go inside. Put it like that. Voy aquí. Okay. Sí, en, caso, en caso de que no esté funcionando el. ¿Cómo se llama? Esto acá. Esto aquí, como que lo va a. Lo voy a poner donde tiene que ir. Ok, déjame verificar en esto. Right there. Let's see the reference I have here. Let's see. Uh, where is the chisels? Chisels. Okay, right there. I need to pull like, like that. And you know what? Let me do something. Mm. Kind of like this. Like that. <coughs> uh, right here. Top. B. F, grip fill, and there we go. Mm. There you go. Pretty solid, right? But I need to put like, uh, like that. Yeah. So for this, now let's create the thing. Mm. Okay. Get just to select it. Mm. Create. I gotta create a cube. A cube. Hmm. Right there, and this one right there, kind of like that. S X. S Y. Extra again. S Y. S X. Del mismo material. Uh, ¿A qué te refieres? So like here, and let's create something just in here. Let's see my reference. Okay, just gonna put this here, something like that. And I'm gonna. I can actually use in this stage art ops to create seriously solid crease right there, but I'm going traditional.
So now I just need to make a variation of the thing. So I mean, no, I'm just gonna do this. Just gonna. There's gonna be, and this gonna be at this one. So if I move this, everything is, everything is the right place. Is the same color, but one selection. O sea, digamos que yo tengo, okay. Uh, Material cycle. Digamos que tengo este en este color. Let me. Let me go back here. No. Ok. Tengo esto acá, ok. You know what? Wait. Vamos acá. Ok, digamos que tengo esto aquí con un color, quiero poner este mismo color de este, simplemente selecciono este y después este, control L, presiono, selecciono materiales y listo, ambos van a tener los mismos materiales. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks for that, Craig. Because the, oh shoot, yeah, it's freakishly small. Let me fix that. So if I move this here and I put it in the hand, and I put it right there, it's gonna, oh, it's gonna be like <laughs> it's gonna be like a pencil or something for him. Oh my Jesus! Yeah, that's a good point. Okay, there you go. Now let me fix that. Now let me take this material. Asset management is freakishly awesome. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. So let me scale this guy here. Scale now. I just gonna fix one second. I'm just gonna fix this. I can actually work on this. I'm going to delete this, I don't need it. Yeah, it's pretty small, yeah. Still. So like this, all of this. Let me put the... Because it is selected, activate 3D cursor. And select the whole thing and scale. And Z, no, wait. Yes. Yeah, this goes really off. Nothing that I can fix. There you go. Ok, 
kind of, kind of. This looks to be bigger, of course, but the handle looking much better. Just gonna a little bit bigger here. Here. Yeah, that's sometimes you just you just need to make the mistake. That's how you learn, right? I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna forget that now. <laughs> so let me put this right there. Let me go here. I'm just gonna. There you go. I don't wanna scale the object actually. If I scale the object. Those scales gonna be in the actual data from the app, so I got to go individually, and uh, it's, it's a mess. So I better just do it like that. This looks right to you guys. Probably oh, looks right. Yeah. Okay, right there. So I need to make a variation of that. Tip now. First, let me rotate this to the front. There you go. Looks thin, so I'm just gonna scale here. Let me see how it looks. That's X, not too much. Alright, I got the first one, so I need to make a variation of this. So just gonna duplicate the whole thing and uh, I'm just gonna change this. So I have a few a few here, so let me see what I can change. I'm just gonna scale. That's gonna gonna do. This one is gonna be like like this. So what I did there, I have a curve here. Let's say I have 
let's say that I have this, wait, this, like that, right? But I want it straight, right? I'm just gonna slice, you know, like that, slide it right there. And it's gonna correct. They're gonna take the position from this one, and when I go down again, it's gonna take the position of this one. So it's gonna kind of like it fixing the whole that path. It's a pretty good way to actually correct that. Here, let me create something interesting right there. Something like that. Just gonna create one here. Like that. And you can do this. There we go. We got two. Okay. We create one more. Where is that? There's a shape that I want to do. But I think I'm not going to use this. Yeah, I'm going to use another cube. It's a different shape. Kind of the same, but it's not.
something like that. Right here. Like this. This S X like that. Let's make it First, let me create this here. This X. This X. I know weird shapes. So now I need to create with this one, but a different here. I think this is going to be enough, so I'm just going to move all this here. And let's see what else. I'm not there. This is kind of like right there. All right. I need water.
You gotta work, hold to your lower. <laughs> Good luck. Have a nice day. Okay, let's see. Alright, first I need to fix this. It's disconnected. And that doesn't look good. I can fix it. That right there, fix. So what I'm gonna be doing now is just kind of just like that, fixing stuff. And let's see what else I can add here. Oh, that thing for holding the... Wait, wait, wait a second. Hold this... Wait, wait, one second. Give me one minute, I think. How many guys? Oh gosh, wait. I already got that. <laughs> this is unbelievable. But I saved the wrong file. Anyways, I'm just gonna copy that from Blender. Find that file that I have. I'm gonna copy it. And I'm gonna copy this thing and go here. And let's say I'm gonna put. Right there. There you go. Bam. It's a good thing for now. Your blender is freakishly awesome. So this is basically. Let me put this. I think, let me see how I got it here. goes to the back of the thing right there and that can actually go there oh, it's gonna be in the other rotation so it's gonna be something like like this right there so he can actually take a hold it right there those ropes and stuff you can actually. Oh my god, looks freakishly big. I like it. I love it. Alright. Yep. Because the point is, I made this. But I save it in older version. And open the. Anyways. Mistakes. So let me copy this other thing that I have here. And I'm gonna copy right there. There you go. There you go. What else did I did in that model that I ha I don't have in this one? Interesting. I think that's that's all. Yeah. I think that's gonna be all. <laughs> now. Yeah. Is this gonna be a hammer? Have to be a big one. That's the name. <laughs> hammer guy. Hogan. Yeah. Yeah. You're right, Nate. Okay, let me close this one right there, and bam. Good. Yeah, I know, but this guy's strong. Look at those muscles. Look at those arms. Yeah, he can do it. Yeah. So, Nate, let's see if we can actually... If I can rig this guy, if we can put it in, uh, in Unity. Make some cool stuff. All right. Let's get going. Now I need to select another piece. Gonna put something here, something there. Let me hide this for a second. And I think I can add some rope around him somewhere, holding something. Yeah, we can, you know, smash stuff in the dungeon. <laughs> that would be pretty awesome. Making some animation with this guy. Holy dear. Alright. This piece right there. No idea. I can actually put it right here holding something in the shield. 
called in something. He will look pretty awesome inside of the dungeon. Uh, let's see. Let me draw. Let me draw. Yeah, let's draw. Hey Sean, how you doing man? Welcome to the live stream. Seriously? It can be broken? Oh! I have a pretty, some pretty interesting ideas right now in my head. Okay, let's see. Uh, I can put... Uh, let's see the ropes, the ropes. Oh, I'm drawing in the view. This is not good. Right. Chris Pencil. Surface. There you go. The problem is that I don't want to put some fancy stuff here because this guy... But you know what? Huh. This guy can create whatever he wants so I think and those little things let me see where I can put those let's see let me see Yeah. Yeah, some damage and stuff here. Something really cool, really freakishly cool texture right there. Here I can put something else. Yeah. Let's see. Sorry guys, this is a, this usually this creation process takes time because you need to you know find the actual shapes or whatever you're doing and you have been creating this character basically in live streams so my brain needs to be like fast you need to think fast <laughs> oh shit I need to I need to I need some coffee or something I need some chocolate yes Yeah, if you rush the process, it's not going to be good. That's for sure. I need to take my time on this. I want to create something cool here. I don't want to put a sword on him. He's not the kind of guy that's gonna carry a sword. So he's the kind of guy that's gonna smash stuff.
<laughs> Hogan Smash. Yeah. That sounds cool, huh? I got this clay face. I love it. I think I can create something with this. He's not the kind of guy that's going to use a spear either. So. Ándale compadre, que tenga buena noche, veo. Nos vemos en el próximo. Gracias, veo. Genial, genial. Un gusto tenerte por acá, compañero. Ándale. Buen viaje, bien. Hacía tiempo que no nos conectábamos, ¿no? Sí, man. Sí, man. Take care. Thanks, man. Me, where is my phone? My phone. Still on the live stream, guys. Recording a video for my Instagram, guys. Hope you don't mind. All right, let me find. I think I have.
Okay. <clears throat> Not this. Mm. I got so many references here. I think I found something. Some more metals. Let's see. It's right there, there we go. There we go. Create a new piece right here. Let me cut here. Get down and let's just Right there, and this one.
I think I can create something I'm gonna put this piece right here. Some kind of shoulder thing. Still don't know if I'm gonna keep it. But it just looks awesome in my mind. I think in a live stream I said that whenever you have an idea, just go and do it. And if you decide to keep it later, just keep it. If you don't, just delete it. But those ideas, whenever you have those ideas, you gotta, you gotta do it. You gotta do it. Yeah, if, if you're doing something, you probably don't gonna have that idea again. It's probably not gonna not gonna look you're gonna probably you're probably gonna forget is what I'm trying to say so if you just go for it you can maybe do something great with that what's going on Okay, let me let me try this again. Right.
He needs to protect his shoulders. That's... Yeah, why not? There's a voice in my head trying to say, keep it simple, keep it simple. <laughs> that's what I'm trying to, that's what I'm trying to do. Keep it simple. Not too complicated. Yeah, let me keep it like that. I think I like it. I think I like it. So I need to create something here to hold this piece right there. <laughs> yeah, uh, well, you know, not all the time, I don't have that voice in my head, not all the time, you know, not usually, usually after three hours doing stuff, I just noticed that I added too much, so I need to go back and... But I mean, it's a process, you... Not everything is perfect. You need to make mistakes, learn from, from those mistakes. If you don't learn, you're gonna do it again. <laughs> For sure, you're gonna do it again. All right, I think I'm gonna keep this. So now let's do something here. Uh, 
right there. Hmm. I'm just gonna put it right there and get out. I don't even want to think the consequences of putting this right here. <laughs> oh my god, this process. Not all the time you, you know, See you, Craig, man. Thank you for being here, man. Have a good night. I think I can put some rope here cr across the thing and some cool ring right there holding that thing. Yeah, let me do that. Let me move this to another layer and we'll put the ring right there. Jesus, <laughs> I turned the view and just messed everything up. Wow. Okay, so the rope is gonna be in that direction, holding something like, yeah. And the other side is gonna be kind of the same thing. So, pretty much that's the idea. Let's just turn into 3D. Let me just delete the whole thing. Just wanted to show you what I have in my mind right now. Yeah, grease pencil. The problem is that when you're drawing with with a uh, grease pencil in in a three D object, and you have like a a few more objects on top of the other, and you're drawing like crazy, like oh dear lord, this is really good. Then then you keep drawing. When you move the camera, oh yes, everything is gonna be like poof, a disaster because you're drawing on top of all those objects. <laughs> it's gonna be a mess. All right, gonna put this right here, this white right there, and that one right there, and that one right here. Gonna deactivate. Yeah, exactly. So many times that happened to me. 
and the, the drawing on the view you're just drawing on the view if you move the view you just lose the the perspective right <laughs> that is something something that you know when you're not concentrating what you're doing it's just it just happen okay let me put this like that and I'm gonna move this here and this here like that so let me add solid define it's gonna be to the other side like that <laughs> yeah it's just Nate the problem is that I don't know I just it happened to me too because I'm so concentrated on what I'm doing that I just want to get the thing done right I just want to draw because I have the idea in my head but I forgot that I had to come here Chris pencil and select uh, surface it's currently always here and you know by default <laughs> such a mistake right okay what I'm gonna do here I gotta make a hole right there and to make a hole you're gonna use boolean or stuff I'm gonna use um, of course I'm gonna use oh okay I'm going to use wait mm, deco uh, no um, hor ups okay I got I forgot I had this still with this there you go just gonna move this to the other side right here and you're gonna do the same I know <laughs> you you notice that right now Nate are you blind <laughs> I gotta keep it in the same position because I'm just gonna use the same thing and I'm gonna make one here So now let me take a little piece of this and the duplicator right here. And I'm just gonna leave that.
pretty interesting there we go like that this now here you got some more interactions here like that curves are freaking awesome I think you're gonna put it right here to hold it here to the to the back. Yeah, I think you're gonna do that. something to eat I'm so hungry right now <laughs> seriously Oh my god, yeah, that can do it. Yeah. That probably will break that, right? Particle system in Unity. How that works. Good? <laughs> so you were experimenting, right? Yeah, that usually happens. There's the curve, right there. Mm. 
What if I... this right here or hmm wait this I can put this to the back holding this or Hey Tristar, ¿cómo estás, Vivo? ¿Todo bien? Gracias por estar aquí, compadre. So, let me put this. I think. I think, I think. Hmm, I'm not sure. But this for mobility, for mobility right there, I don't know, it doesn't doesn't give me anything I'm just gonna put it down to here grabbing that yes let's do that I'm just gonna do something crazy here and then it's gonna help okay there you go oh dear and like this like this In front of the sh of the of the metal thing, it's not a good idea either. So, hmm. hmm. What if I can put this here and it's gonna hold that too? Yep, let's do that. take that up from that spot
There we go. Now I can feel that it's actually on top of each shoulder. Okay. Much better. This right here is... Mm, I don't know. Find a place for this, grabbing here, this, and to be safe. Hmm. I'm just gonna leave it there for now. There's probably going to be something here to, to hold that. But for now I just need to keep going. What if... Okay, let me fix this.
No, that that doesn't. No, I don't like it. Nope. No, 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 no. That can't be there. I think we'll just do another layer. There you go. I'm just gonna leave it right there, like that, for now. Just because I need to find a better idea and hope this is something. And I'm probably gonna use this one or this one. So, one of those, or maybe this one. So, but for now. I think this is good. Let me select this. This one too, but uh, you know. Okay, good. Well, I think I'm gonna stop here two hours and eight minutes. Wow, okay. Time goes fly. something here oh <laughs> Saved by the bell. Wow. Yeah, I just did that. <laughs> it's a nightmare of all of us. Sometimes you just forget, right? Save again. You see that, Nate? The good thing about this menu is, is that when you're in rendering, I said I'm in rendering right there, right? Well, let me do something. Wait. When you're in rendering, sometimes you need more space, right? And you press N and take this off, the viewport is gonna automatically is gonna resize, right? But with these menus, that's not gonna happen because they just vanish in front of the render. You see that? Every time you open the menu, he's just gonna appear like BAM! By magic. <laughs> so it's not gonna, you know, interfere with the with the rendering thing that you're doing. It's pretty awesome. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can activate that in the system thing for the blender. All right, guys, my voice is crazy right now. I, I, I'm, I'm out of here. I think this is good for today. I'm probably gonna do some more stuff off uh, live stream, thinking a little bit more about you know the general thing. But I think for the next live stream that I'm gonna be doing, this guy, I'm gonna do in details, starting creating more detailed stuff for this guy. Okay, guys. All right, I think it's gonna be all. Thank you all for watching. Thank you all for being here. If you haven't subscribed already to the channel, just go right now and just subscribe to the channel. It's not gonna, it's gonna kind of kill you guys. Come on, it's gonna help you a lot, right? Share the video. It's gonna probably gonna be up in a few days. It's gonna be ready so you can see it off live stream. All right, guys. See you. Bye bye. Have a good night.